In this screencast, we are going to look at the Google Calendar Event Publisher Guide. I use this site for two things. First, to create buttons that allow people to save an individual event from my site. And second, to create a button that allows people to subscribe to the entire calendar. This is a workshop that I will be doing in 13 days, and we are going to create this Add to Google Calendar button. This is the Event Publisher Guide. I never remember this URL, so I actually just search Google Event Publisher Guide, and then will come up as the first hit. We're going to let people save an individual event from your site. Clicking this link just jumps you down to the right place on the page. The what and the when are the only things that are required. I'm going to set my workshop for October the 10th at 1.30 and I have to do it in 24 hour time. It's two hours long, so it ends at 3.30. And again, you have to set the date to the 10th of October. And you do have the option to do all day. Where and description aren't required, but I always like to fill them out. All of my workshops are paperless, so in the description I usually put a link to the agenda. You have the option to show as available or busy. I'm going to choose busy. You also have the option to enter email addresses of guests. I never do this since it's going to be uh, posted on my website. And then you have the option of three buttons. I'm going to pick the middle one. Website name and address are no longer required. And then you just click create button HTML. And this will generate the code that you need for the website. So I'm going to go ahead and copy it all. I'm back on my site. I want to add my button in the sidebar, so I'm going to click Edit Sidebar. And I need to add a sidebar item. And I need to add a text page element. And I actually want mine to be right below Countdown, so I'm going to move it up. And I'm going to edit it. It's got a place for a title. Uh, I don't want a title, so I'm going to leave that blank. Down here has got a place for you to uh, paste the code. If you paste it in here, it won't work. You actually need to click on the HTML. This gives you a place to paste the HTML code. You can click Preview to see what it's going to look like. And then it worked. So I'm going to do Update. Click OK. Save my changes. And now head back to my site. And I now have a Google Calendar button. When you click the button, it'll pop up in your calendar. It has the title and the times that I set, where the event is going to occur, uh, the description, which I included the agenda, and it's showing me it's busy, and I can save the event. And it will be added to my calendar.